I'm Mitchell Zukoff. Welcome to Shangri-La. This is a true story that took me around the world and into the past. The island of New Guinea in 1945, to be exact. Near the end of the Second World War, Allied pilots found a huge valley where maps said there would only be mountains. It was home to thousands of prehistoric tribespeople. Stories and rumors about the valley spread, and soon it was called Shangri-La, the name borrowed from the fictional paradise in Lost Horizon. There was no way to enter the valley, but those who flew over it became members of the Shangri-La Society. May 13, 1945, 24 military men and women boarded a plane for a flight to Shangri-La. On the way into the valley, the plane crashed. I reveal how and why in the book. Twenty-one of those aboard were killed. Survivors included a lieutenant whose twin brother died in the plane, a sergeant who suffered a terrible head wound and amnesia, and a beautiful corporal named Margaret Hastings. To protect them from the natives, the military sent in a team of Filipino-American paratroopers led by a gung-ho American captain. A rogue filmmaker who'd been a Hollywood actor and a jewel thief parachuted in too to get ready for the first wash in days. With no way out, the army settled on a dangerous plan to drop gliders to the valley floor then snatch them back into the air with the survivors on board. Meanwhile, the most powerful warlord in the valley began plotting to kill the outsiders. I hope you enjoy the book.